friends and welcome back to my channel. Today is a demo review and uh, that's about it, I guess, of the Main Choices Heavenly Halo Softening Milk. One of you has suggested that I try this product and I was very excited when I saw the whole product lineup. Apparently, when I went on the Main Choices website, it directed me to Target because Target is the only retailer that sells this line. I almost went crazy and bought the whole thing. And I thought, Alicia, you're really only interested in the styling products. And therefore, just get the one. Just get the softening milk. Just to touch on a couple of more products, I have the Target website on here. They have the Heavenly Halo Herbal Hair Tonic and Deep Hydration Conditioner. They have a hydration mask. Also a deep hydrating shampoo, a pre-poo, which I almost purchased as well, but I thought I'll leave it for another time. And when I do get it, I'll come back on here and film. In addition, they have a serum oil mist, the softening milk, which I have, the, what is this, body lotion and a shower wash, body wash. And I think the whole line is based on, well, this one has Umutanga oil. I'm sorry if I messed that up. Which I think all the products have. And it's very hydrating, softening, all without being greasy. And it's chock full of these hydrating ingredients. And this is what I used after I tried the Curl Junkie Coffee Cocoa Cream Light. And although I love the definition it gave and the shape it had my hair in, I was still in need of a little more moisture and I'm happy to share that this indeed provides a ton more moisture but it still leaves the hair defined and in a really fantastic shape. I did apply a little bit of my Uncle Funky's Daughter's Glossy because anytime that something dries in a very light cast on me, I use an oil finisher or a spray to break apart that cast but still leave the hair frizz free and to give it a little more movement. Here's a close up and I am very pleased with the definition that I have. I'm especially pleased with my size. I did go in and you'll see on this demo I made sure that I section very carefully in small parts I make sure to finger curl a lot of my side curls that get neglected and it's hard because they just get lost in the mix and I found that when my hair dried that definition stayed intact and also raking through was incredibly easy this formula has fantastic slip it's very detangling and I didn't feel the need to reach for an additional detangling at all. It's nice to know that I could just use this one product for detangling, moisture, and definition. I'm also looking forward to using this as a second or third day refresher. Let's see what's on, let's read what's on the label first of all. This is 8 ounces for $15.99. It says it's a daily moisturizing softening milk simplifies the styling process and helps improve texture drenches and helps improve texture drenches dry thirsty hair with intense hydration helps deliver instant moisture to inner core of hair shaft Whoa. restores hydration levels in dehydrated hair helps to reduce breakage and minimize shedding improves hair's appearance and manageability infused with nourishing vitamins and nutrients gentle enough to use daily on all hair types and all the claims are Penetrates to hydrate from inside out. It restores hydration levels in dry, thirsty hair. Helps to restore natural luster and shine. Leaves hair feeling soft and tangle-free. Helps to minimize shedding and breakage. I'm not sure how well it will minimize the shedding because I lose quite a bit of hair as you saw in my updated wash and go video. <laughs> I'm looking to use this every day, especially as a daily moisturizer and curl refresher. I feel just from the texture itself, it's very light and silky that it won't leave my hair with a, an, a residue or it won't feel very textured from me piling product on product on a daily basis. And I think it is helpful because of the fact that it does not contain mineral oil, petrolatum. It doesn't say it does not have silicones, but I'm reading down the ingredient list and it seems pretty clean. I don't see any silicones in here. If I'm missing it, let me know down below. 
But the second ingredient in here is the umutanga seed oil. Umutanga means it's chock full of it in here, followed by the palmarosa oil uh, and different botanical extracts, vitamin E, panthenol. It's a, it's a clean ingredient list, and I use this in conjunction with their 3-in-1, which I always forget how much I love. That thing detangles so well, and even after rinsing it out, it leaves the hair very silky and soft and prepped well for whatever detangler or styler you will apply. And I find that it's super helpful when the hair is already detangled and smooth, and applying this after the 3-in-1 was... A dream. Here's the back and I pretty much I like how it turned out. I love the shape of it. This part of my hair stayed pretty much intact. It did get a little frizzy because I I have been messing with it and that's basically what happens. All in all I highly recommend this product because again it does everything it says it's going to do and the fact that it left my hair very shiny, soft, light, not greasy, but my hair feels super moisturized. My hair feels a lot softer than it did when I applied just the Coffee Cocoa Cream Light. But I think if I wanted to feel even more hydrated, I could apply more of this in smaller sections. I went in very quickly because I didn't have a lot of time to be thorough in my sectioning today. I feel if I went in with smaller sections using the softening milk that my hair could have felt a lot more hydrated. Not greasy, but just a little more because this part right here feels a little dry and I could have sectioned that more, applied more product, and I will do that again next time. Tomorrow though, I will get on here if I can and see how this works as a refresher. I'm looking forward to see how it applies on freshly spritzed hair versus hair from the shower, how it combs through, how it dries, does it feel textured, does it dry with a, a film on the hair and all those things that we look for in a refresher. Definitely stay tuned. I, for the most part right now, I feel really great about this product. I will definitely use it again and repurchase. I think it's at a reasonable price point. There are products cheaper than $15.99 for eight ounces, but I think for the ingredient list and what it does and how my hair feels, I think $16 is a good price for me. It still might be very expensive to some, and I understand that, but if you're looking to splurge on a drugstore product or products sold in drugstores, I think you should definitely take a look at this one. Let me know down below if you use the Heavenly Halo softening milk or any other product products from the Heavenly Halo line. Definitely recommend another product you would combine it with, whether it be from Heavenly Halo or another product line altogether. And if you have the softening milk, how do you like it, how you don't like it, how do you use it, and all that good stuff. Thank you again, friends, for watching. I hope this video helped. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And until then, I'll see you on here again with another tutorial, demo, or chit-chat, or get ready with me, or review. Take care, and I'll see you again soon.